everyone, and welcome to another Pokemon card video. Today we'll be opening the Ancient Power Box. I've had this one sitting just waiting to be opened for months and months. I think I bought this one last year, actually. So we finally get to see what is inside these packs. We've also got five promo cards with this one. So what do you say we open this guy up and check it out? Actually, wait, we've got some cool stuff on the back. Look at this. Ancient Power from the Dawn of Time. And I guess you guys can read that if you like. Let me see if I can get it focused in so you can actually read that. Draw strength from the ancient world. All kinds of stuff. Yeah, well, hopefully if you wanted to read that, you actually could. Some cool art in the back. Now let's actually open it right here. Yeah. Ah, crud. Gosh dang it. The plastic has been really, really complicated lately. Well, actually, hold on. Now that I'm complaining about it, it's actually working pretty well. Wow. You know, plastic, you are so nice, you can sit right there. You can be in frame. Now we just have to get inside here. Hopefully it's not taped up. It's not. Nice. Boom. Whoa! That was easy. I don't think there's anything left in there. So let's take this shield off and let's look at these five promo cards first. So first off we have Tyrant and Tyrantrum. All of them have this like sparkly hollow uh, pattern I think. Kind of hard to see it on Tyrantrum but it is there. So we have Tyrant. Let's see if I can get him in better lighting so you can see the sparkles. Uh, you can kind of see the sparkles, not too well there. But we also have an Aurorus and an Amora. Both also have that sparkly sparkles. Again, I can't really see it that well on Amora, but it's definitely there. And they're not marked as promos, but that hollow pattern, you basically won't see these cards with that kind of hollow pattern, if they're even hollow at all, in the actual sets. So you gotta get the Ancient Power Box to get this variant, basically. Let's take a closer look at that Fossil Researcher as well. So you can see he's actually got like a hollow all the way down here and up in this picture. So that's actually a really cool card. I'm digging that one. So that is all the promos for this set. And we've also got three packs to go with it. This is a pretty relatively cheap box set. I think that, um, I think you can get it for like $10 nowadays online. So it's pretty cheap. So if you wanted to get those promos or those variant holographics, yeah, you can go for it. But here we have two Furious Fists and one Flash Fire. So let's do the Flash Fire first. We didn't get a very good Flash Fire pack last time. So let's try to... Do a little bit better this time. Kabam. Has it been, how long has it been since we've got a good flash fire pull? I feel like ever since the last booster box, we just haven't been doing good with the set. Here we have a Fletchender, Palpad, Sneasel. Whoa, double Sneasel. Which, guys, which Sneasel do you prefer? This is the uncommon one, this is the common one. I think I actually like the common one a little bit better. He does look a little bit more menacing, but I don't know, it's a nice art, I like that one. We have a C Dot, Skrelp, Scraggy, Flabebe. The reverse holographic is a spritzy back to back fairies right there. Just a common, but still pretty cool. And the last card of the Flash Fire pack is a Pidgeot. Non holographic rare. Keeping up our bad streak of Flash Fire. Assuming I haven't pulled something good from Flash Fire and I'm just forgetting about it. But I think we've been having bad luck with Flash Fire. Furious Fist, however, did pretty good last time, so let's see if it does that again. Yeah. And got it. Okay. So for the first flash fire pack, we have, wow, we have an Amora right there. So we just got the fancy version of that. Now we've got the regular one as well. Got ourselves a Focus Sash and a Mountain Ring. I'm not sure, is it like a ring made out of a mountain? We have a Makuhita, Gothita, Magmar, Pikachu, Pancham, one of my favorites from Gen 6. Oh, we have a Reverse Holographic Excelgore. Very nice. And the last card of the pack is an Aurorus. So we got another one of these. This was an Amora and an Aurorus in the same pack. So I've got quite a few of these non-holographic rares, but oh well. We have one more uh, Furious Fist packs to go. So maybe, just maybe, we'll have something, something pretty cool. Not that Aurorus is not cool. I mean, I'm digging the Aurorus. And actually that Excelgore Reverse Holo is pretty sick as well. But it's just nothing, nothing too rare, anything like that. But here we have a Sparkling Robe. We have a Jaw Fossil. Watchog. Plusle. Machop. What, actually, a really cool Machop. It's got like some confetti around him. I don't know if he won a fight or something. We have a Golette. Bellsprout. Mianfu. Oh, Electabuzz Reverse Hollow. I still cannot get over how such a cool looking Electabuzz is just a common, but oh well. The last card of the video, last pack magic. Nothing, guys. We got ourselves a Glaceon. My favorite of the evolutions, but still just a non-holographic rare. So nothing really too crazy in this opening right here, but some really cool promos. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next week. We'll be opening a booster box from the Ancient Origin set. 
So, see you guys then. Take care.